Please leave a message after the... It's not open casting. The character has looked a certain way for over 75 years. You don't just change that. That was part of the reason why people, myself included, were bothered by Jordan being cast as Human Torch. That's not what the Human Torch looks like. Take the book, make it real. That's what most fans want. So you hear this argument a lot. I guess it depends how much into the, the law you're in or this is where I want to hear you guys' opinion. I have an opinion. I haven't said on the show before, but I want you guys to go first on what you think of this. Do you think he's right? Do you disagree? Do you think it's pick and choose? It depends on the character, how popular they are. What do you guys think? I know. I mean, I, th- I thought... Um, you can start dis- with Superman. Well, I was going to say, if you want. I mean, to dispute the point with the, the latest Spider-Man release with the... Uh, into the Spider-Man universe when there was an, a different incarnation of Spider-Man. You mean Miles Morales? Um, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Well, that's the, the animated one. Where yeah, that's Miles. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's Miles. Okay, yeah, 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 yeah. So that one, that was a gr- I actually just watched that last week. I thought that was a great one. Mm. And, you know, so it can be done. Um, you know, you can see, obviously, with the... Um, that's, actually, that's I was gonna, I was bit, gonna, I was gonna go. You know, a bit a different, different. That's a bit different because that's not Peter Parker. It's not Peter Parker, that's but a, no, yeah. but there, it was an iteration of Spider Man which people didn't like. I mean, there was a bit of a backlash. Sure. You know, initially, when it first came out, they were like, "There can't be a black Spider Man." And then you saw sure. it, yep. and then you yep. just saw actually, okay. this you know really did work. Mm-hmm. As far as um, you know, for like Superman, a black Superman, I, I I would question why there is a need to do it. You know. Cool. I mean that's that's my that's my mm. stance on it. So do you I agree mean, with the points he made then? About he has to look the same, <laughs> the Esco, the face, you know. Well, no, it, I mean no, they don't they don't have to be a, a mirror image, but I mean, yeah, I mean I I just don't get the need. I mean I'd rather there'd be a a, a black if they were going to go into the superhero universe, there'd be a, 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 an original black character, you know, with an original story. Sure. As opposed okay. to, well, let's just, you know, make this quote unquote diverse and then you know, step on that. And yeah, it, it sure. doesn't, it, it causes more harm than good. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Okay. Mm-hmm. Well, that's one way to see it. <laughs> is Stan Lee going? Yeah, I'm, I'm kind of with Jolie on it. But mm-hmm. the only thing that I'll add is that, like, yes, uh, it would be weird. It's just, it, Obviously, it's going to be weird if you've seen Superman as like this olive or like a Caucasian character all this time mm. for all these years then yes it's going to be weird if Michael B. Jordan ended up playing him um, but at the same time that's what is kind of happening in this day and age you have uh, creators kind of pandering to mm-hmm. uh, like the the whims of of the of the times can like you think of an example just well Miles, Miles Morales is an example um, or the uh, Thor becoming a woman um, like that's a good point L from Death Note in the live in the live action being a black guy. That's you a know, great this, point. This is all That's stuff that point. is kind of like mm-hmm. that looks weird. But at the same time, if the creator wants to do that, what can you do? <laughs> you can't sue them. Like you know what I mean? I I I guess what I'm trying to say is when people people get a bit carried away, like getting butt hurt about it. Just just don't watch it. Like you know what I mean? That's that's my because for example, I didn't watch Death Note because I, I the knew movie, it was gonna be, the Netflix movie one exactly yeah because oh. I knew it was going to be terrible anyway. <laughs> but at the same time if I see something that looks like that looks like it's not really going to work then I just don't watch it but some people just get so carried away mm. and then they kind of expose themselves they expose <laughs> their true agenda <laughs> which is that they don't like diversity and that's, yeah, that's, I that's, think, a good, that's a good point I actually genuinely want to know what a conversation really is because if you're saying that can there be any form of race or colour shall we say mm. playing a fictitious character of course they can yes of course Look, yes. do you know what I mean let's yeah. not now, if you're saying, oh, I actually want to have mm. the screenplay adaptation of a narrative of a comic book, mm. then yeah, then you want to play as closely as you can. Let's let's go with should. Should play it. Let's go yeah, with yeah. not could. Let's go with because anything's possible, but yeah, should yeah. they then? Right. So if you're literally saying that we're going to do this uh, comic book um, issue 314, then yeah, you should do it exactly as it was you know what I mean? If you're doing a screenplay adaptation, mm. but if you're saying, "Oh, actually, it's just a superhero film," mm. I can make, I can write, I can have the best writers, you know, in the yeah. green room, and we can come up with an original. Then guess what? Anyone can come from Krypton. Mm-hmm. Don't <laughs> yeah. have to be, you know, they don't yeah. have to. So it doesn't have to be uh, people plan. up in, yeah, mm. up in arms about that. And at the end of the day, I think what well, again, this conversation is, it is, it is 
divided into racial politics. Yeah. Definitely. Yeah, yeah. Definitely. You know, that's, the, I mean, that's the undertone. And, there, yeah. and if you think about Superman as the entire embodiment of quote unquote white supremacy, then <laughs> which is it's a, it's, a, it's, a, it's a white guy yeah you know who, who's the, a better quote unquote race it's the than super you put in there that helps even more right yeah the, <laughs> super, uh, super. The, yeah. Yes. the one thing I would say you'd have to be open to um, if we can obviously you know so the, a creator can you know manipulate the you know that the uh, super superhero universe there um, like if if we were to change it with Blade is that can we change Blade into a white guy or could we change mm. You know, I mean, uh, you know, of course. I, I, I mean, if you're being fair, then yeah. the answer is yes. Yeah, yeah, you can. Mm. Yeah, you can. Like, you know, I mean, even with other movies, fictitious, you know, characters like I don't know, Shaft. You I know, can you do that? that? You know, I mean, in terms of that way, then yeah. I mean, I, I think we could we should open the floor up and say if we could do it for that, then we could do it for this. I think a question the guy tried to hit on as well, which I think he said mm. basic verbatim, is he the same character if he's a different color? If Superman is black, is that Superman? So here's the thing, right? It's yes. not necessarily the individual, but actually what the what the the signal or the representation mm-hmm, is. Mm-hmm. That's what heroes are, full stop, right? Yeah, yeah. So yeah. you can have anyone behind a mask. Yeah. And yeah. the reason why Superman in of itself might not work per se mm-hmm. is because he plays an alias, Clark Kent. Yeah. And Clark Kent, right, let's not be around a bush. He can very much easily, quote unquote, blend in because the majority of that world yeah. is a white person. Oh, exactly. yeah, yeah. Exactly. And that's that Come very same up. rhetoric mm-hmm. with, exactly. you know, Idris Elba playing James Bond. Because if Idris Elba, being a black guy, six foot three, was to go to China and pretend to be a double agent, <laughs> it's like, well, no, I know that black guy. <laughs> of course. <laughs> I've seen have him. You, have you seen that black guy? You know, yeah. Yeah, I saw him hanging around yeah, the yeah, kitchen. Yeah, yeah. He's, trying to be, the police. he's trying to be incognito. <laughs> it doesn't make sense. Yeah. <laughs> it sounds like you're fighting both sides of the argument then. No. Because then you've got something to, you know. Yeah, exactly. Like, yeah. And, and my argument is basically yeah. if you create a universe in which you can just play around with it as you want, then obviously yeah. the protagonists or the heroes or the superheroines could be anything you want. Yeah. yeah. A lot of superheroes and superheroines, they are the symbol. They are not the individual. I would agree. I would agree. And so therefore the individual could be any color, race, gender, sexual preference, orientation, religious, all of that, right? Because they are behind that, you know, No, no, I I agree. I mean, if it makes sense in that universe, it's plausible. The plot is uh, plausible. Then I'd be be saying, okay, that's absolutely fine. You know, but... um, but yeah, I mean, with, with the whole Superman thing, I mean, it would inevitably, you know, inevitably, you know, catch a lot of fire for that there. But if it was created in a universe where it makes sense, hence, uh, you know, that whole uh, Spider-Man example, you know, when people first saw the trailer, immediately up in arms, mm. a, a universe was created where this made absolute sense. And then, you know, people just saw the actual characters and the story itself, you know. Like, um, what's even a great example of this? Is it Jason Todd who took up Batman for a little while? Dick Grayson. Oh. Dick yeah. Grayson. Yeah. And yeah, then yeah. after Dick Grayson, who was the second Robin? Uh, Tim Drake. Oh, no, 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 sorry. Dick Grayson, then it was Jason Todd. Yeah, then it was precisely. Tim Drake, correct. Sorry, but yeah. My point is, mm. at every one stage, apart from Jason Todd, yeah. Dick Grayson was yeah. Batman and people didn't know Batman wasn't around. Yes, correct. Damn. You know, you're such a comic fan. <laughs> so, yeah, right. so yeah, yeah. again, it's yeah. the symbol. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, 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 yeah. You know, they're both white though, so. Of course. Yeah, I mean, we saw the Netflix, right? With people up in arms, a Starfire being black. Yeah. Oh, yes. yeah. Yes, they Even were. Even though she's an alien. I'm pretty sure yeah. stuff, I mean, when I saw it was like pretty orange, or just an alien, you know, it could have been any colour. So, so I think yeah. the crux of this is white people are just going to be mad regardless. That's true. <laughs> so, yeah, so, <laughs> Hermione, Hermione. That'd not, be funny wondering who the hell have you brought here, this pro, <laughs> pro-black activist <laughs> guy. But, I, so. but I, here's my opinion. Even, I'll add on, I agree with all three. You were kind of on the same page. But more than anything to me is fucking laziness. These guys yeah. are like- Corey Barry. We, yeah. Yeah, because we could make a new character, but then we've got all these years of all these other characters. We got, got, we're not going to spend more money on creating these new stories. Let's just take a, a character, all the established character. Mm. You know, this this ties perfectly back to Idris Elba. Hot off the presses, Idris Elba is replacing Will Smith as Deadshot. Deadshot was originally a white character. He's right. been a white character in the law for 30 plus years. 
But yeah. when Rusev came along, obviously the reason Star Power movie, there was reasons why they used, you know, inclusivity, star power, money, you know, from a business perspective, it's a win, win, win. They hit, they tick so many boxes, this is great. Now yeah. they've got Idris Elba, win again, right? But why couldn't they just bring in Black Lightning? Black Lightning, oh, Black yeah. Cat, he's already been the Black Character, why not? Yeah, yeah. It's not popular. Nah. Nah. There's a mini book, but these books don't really sell. Let's get a character that's mid-tier that is doing well. Fucking uh, that guy, what's his name? I just said, Deadshot. Deadshot? Yeah, yeah. yeah he's, he's already on the Arrow. People know him. He's already a big character on Arrow. So people, yeah. he's in people's vision, but he always wears a mask. Mm. On um, the Young Justice the series, Justice League, the movie that came out, they decided to bring Cyborg up. He was in the Teen Titans, right? He wasn't part of the Justice yeah, League. Yeah, he wasn't really. They yeah. upgraded him. Yeah, they did. You know they what I mean? Did, so yeah, like, yeah. so I, I do feel like the industry's learning that, you know what, it's best we try to upgrade because they have been getting backlash consistently, like you said, from um, everything. Every time they've done it, Color Swap, they've got backlash every single time. Not just with the black characters. Scarlett Johansson did Ghost in the Shell. Yeah, but it's the, it's the opposite ends of the spectrum that are arguing because you'll have like the but her like white people who yeah. don't like uh black watching and then you have like leftists no no but why can't we get and I, I understand it's people i guess it was a yeah. i mean with that in, in in her case that there was uh there's a history of white washing well, yeah, like with the aloha no but that's, know, that's the what the argument's Moses, always been yeah, you know, that's the, what they're, they're saying and what they're saying is that we did the color switching because we had to get you in there somehow so i know yeah, you guys don't yeah. like it but yeah. if, what are we supposed to do? There isn't any popular black characters. So again, Netflix, and they try to do Luke Cage and they, they have been propping up lower tier characters, which is the better idea, in my opinion, even though these characters are not popular, even though they're not a strong as Superman, they can't, they're not going to beat the characters, the black characters they made aren't going to beat the bigger ones, but they're trying to upgrade them, which I think is the best part. So And yeah, and the reason that is because of history and legacy. Right? 100%. So you can't fight history. You, you can't. can't. They're trying but to. I've, I've recently learned a new word. Did you say blackwashing? <laughs> <laughs> Stanley, well, I'm going to re- I'm going to listen to this. And I, and I swear to God, you said blackwashing and I'm sure that doesn't right. exist. <laughs> well, it, it's, the idea is to diversify um, a cast, right? Yeah. That's what you're it's talking about. To be fair, right. it is apt. Yeah, it's, yeah, yeah. it's just that's that's what they don't like. No, like, that's it. like Nick yeah, Fury, yeah. for example, is yeah, yeah. You know, you, you'd hear people say, "Yeah, Blackwash." <laughs> <laughs> when when this first, I'll end on this. When this first happened, I actually did agree that mm. you know what, there's not many black characters. We have to start. We just have to put them in there. It's like what they, you know, what they did with the Academy, where they said that we just got to force people in there, and they were like, "Oh, but the black people, they're not qualified. They don't have the." The, 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 the 50 years of knowledge mm, the, the, yeah, I'm like, I'm, I'm, that's a lazy argument of course stuff. it is yeah, and I'm yeah, like, of course, yeah, yeah. so they try to you know I feel like things have happened the way they, they should at first you force them in I understand the companies had a tough thing to do and you get people like this guy that are upset that the, the industry is like you know what we're gonna just hire Michael B. Jordan because we wanna placate to the black audience and you know we wanna show them that we do care even if the other 50 years worth of people are going to be upset. You know, we're going to just do it. But it's it's just not a good idea. And uh, with with characters, big established characters, I don't think they should bother. It's not, when you could just, and I'm, I just want to change the topic now because I want to see, I'm, I'm sick of seeing <laughs> Superman. I'm sick of seeing these guys anyway. I've seen them for 50 fucking years. Make new characters and bring them on. There you go. I mean, how many fucking everywhere. How many Supermans have we had in our past? Too uh, many. We've had too we're, many. We're on the third one or yeah. something like that. And, yeah. and I think what we're actually doing is overlooking something that is actually essential. And they've recently just got an Oscar, right? But Black for Black Panther. It did, yeah. Is the highest grossing movie single solo? Is it you know what I mean? Yeah. Precisely. Yeah. So you know, again, that trope or narrative that black doesn't necessarily sell is being changed. It's it's fast. It's a fast, evidently. Yeah, yeah. No, absolutely. So there's no there's no excuses. Absolutely. I mean, it, it's it's a it's a slow progress, but it's a progress in the right direction. I would imagine there. Yeah. Yeah. Please leave another message at voiceofmail.com.